Hello, ho, ho. A video on Christmas Day? God bless us, everyone, and God bless every stomach pump as well. Welcome to Bizarre Chocolate Crimbo Dinner, limited edition, thank fuck. Handmade in Northumbria, where it frankly should have stayed. And made by the chocolate smiths, who I presume are people who make chocolate stuff, and not some weird tribute act to uh, Morrissey and Johnny Marr and co. If Santa could make his own chocolate bar, it'd be this. No, it wouldn't, because he's probably not an idiot. Scrummy Belgian milk chocolate with the best bits of a veggie Christmas dinner. Marvellous. And also you put veggie Christmas dinner, picture of a turkey. Oh dear, deary me. Right, it's in date, that's something. Ever wished your Christmas dinner was more chocolatey? We have. That's because we're weird in the face. This limited edition bizarre bar combines Belgian milk chocolate and an awful, awful font. And turkey with all the trimmings. What? I said it was veggie a minute ago, now it's... what? So when you say veggie, you just mean it's got some vegetables, it's not vegetarian? I am confused. Um, and it's vegetarian friendly. Oh, for fuck's sake, get your fucking heads together, lads. Right, so it's full of turkey or something, but it's vegetarian. What the bloody hell? What is Christmas without a novelty? We promise it's good. Right, let's just try and get our heads around what's actually in this frickin' thing. A handmade milk chocolate bar with garlic, sage, onion, salt, pepper, salt, and dried cranberry. Onion, salt, and salt. Good. Everything you need at Christmas time. Right, so ingredients are milk chocolate. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So there's then garlic powder, dried sage, onion salt, salt, pepper, citric acid, and dried cranberry. So effectively, there is only really some herbs, a bit of onion, and a bit of cranberry in there. Right. I think I'm down with that. Well, down in the sense that I understand it, not down in the sense that I really want to eat it. What's this annoying thing? Stuck on my thumb. Ow, it's bleeding! Ah, oh, great. Now I've injured myself before my chocolate smith's bizarre bar. Could this day get any less onerous? Right. What's it bloody like, then? The smell's going to be interesting, one imagines. It's very nicely wrapped. Reminds me of the old Wonka bars from the uh, Willy Wonka and the Chocolate Factory film, not the Jolly Depp later version, which I believe is called Charlie and the Chocolate Factory, much like the book, and also it's a bit shite. Oh, God. It just looks like somebody stubbed out a load of cigarettes on a chocolate bar. Good grief. Right. Um, I wonder if it looks all right. What's it like in the middle? It's not really anything much visible, is it? I don't know if you can see that. Yeah, just a lot of... Hmm... Um, that's really unappetising, actually. Right, what does it smell of? It just smells of chocolate. Oh, God, with a hint of stuffing or something. That'll be the sage. Right, I'm going to take a bite. Wish me luck. Oh. oh, it's disgusting. Oh. Oh. Right, it's relatively subtle, but it makes me want to gag. Oh. That's really unpleasant. Um... It's weird, it's not as in-your-face unpleasant as like that uh, chocolate we had that time with the cheese and onion crisps in. But um, there's something deeply unpleasant about it sitting in the back of my throat and making me feel very nauseous. Mm. Wonderful. Oh, God. Ah. Uh, well, Christmas is ruined early this year. Oh, always nice to get it in early. Ah. Uh. I'm going to put that on the not recommended pile, and I shall file it under B for bin. Subscribe for more.